Realiza. Hola, Mato. No, no, no. ¿Qué tal? Bien. Aquí ya lista para iniciar la clase. Está bueno, está bueno. ¿Eh? Yo, yo ahorita conectándome porque no estuve ayer. Sí, así nos dimos cuenta. Se le extrañó, <risa> estuvieron preguntando. Sí, es que tenía un, mi dolorcito de cabeza como algo de gripe. Me, que, me quería dar porque ya, 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 ya pasó. Qué bueno, qué bueno. No hay permiso para enfermarse. Va, de acuerdo, pues. <risa> Nos vemos al rato, pe. Ok. Salud.
Hello, good evening, my friends. Welcome to the class number five. We're going to finish the first unit. Vamos a terminar la primera unidad. So it's really possible, right? So Ellie, hello, good evening. Ellie, hello. Good evening, teacher, hello. Everything okay? So-so. So-so. <laughs> okay. Yes, okay, we're going to start. Mardo, hello, good evening. Nice to see you again, my friend. Good evening, teacher. Okay. Um, how were your days? ¿Cómo estuvieron tus días? Good? Nice? Nice, nice. You were kind of busy. Thank so you. Un poco ocupado, ¿verdad? Kind of busy. Sí, sí, inventory. Okay. Final uh, month. Ah, yes. I have an inventory. Yeah, that, that's kind of common. And it is like it takes a lot of time. It toma bastante tiempo. Realmente toma bastante tiempo. Okay, so uh, welcome to everybody. Um, let me show you here. Okay, Pinto. Hello, Carlos. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. I'm driving right now. Okay, because no problem. My, it's because my camera is off. No, no problem. So when you get but home, I'm, I'm, tell us. I'm listening, teacher. I'm okay. listening. Okay, please. Uh, you're going to be listener, but when you get home, please tell us. Okay, tell me so you can participate, but by now, keep on driving. Yes, yes, yes. Perfect, my friend. Thank you for telling me. I will. Me. I will. Thank you. Nice. Awesome. Okay, so here we have a uh, unit one review. And uh, this is the class number five, as I was uh, saying before. So nice, because after uh, tonight, we have three weeks. Solo tenemos tres semanas de después de esta clase. So that's really, really exciting. Okay, so let me see. The first question, what is the funniest, the funniest thing some friends or relatives have done. ¿Qué es lo más gracioso, chistoso que eh, tus amigos o familiares han hecho? I guess we have kind of funniest anecdotes. Tenemos anécdotas, pues, graciosas. Or maybe we did it. O quizá nosotros la hicimos. That's another story, right? It can be like that. So um, we're going to start with this. Um, do we have volunteers for this first participation? What is the funniest thing some friends or relatives have done? In this case, maybe if we don't have... Um, oh, Ellie, I imagine that you have a lot to tell. Okay, Ellie and then Carlos. Okay. What is the funniest thing, thing some friends or relatives have done? See, my granddaughter dances the chacarón, and she is stupid than a coal. And we children friends the wars with mortar and whistler. Okay, uh, what is chacarón? Que sale un hipopótamo. Chacarón, 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 Okay, okay. So, well. So, how old is your granddaughter? Um, en una, un party, eh, mi nieta intentaba bailarlo. Eh, yes. Pero es, tan, es tan tiesa que nos okay. causó gracia. Okay, she, she was very, yes. No, I, I'm, I, am, I'm, I am asking, um, how old is your daughter? Five years, uh, ten years, old, ¿qué edad tiene? Um, tiene, um, she is eight, eight years. Ah, eight years. Yes, she, she is a she is a little one. Okay. <laughs> okay, I have heard about Chacaron song. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you, Ellie. Uh, I don't know why grandkids, los nietos, grandkids are kind of funny. They always do like funny things, right? So. That, that's really common. Good for you because you, you can laugh or smile. Y tú te diviertes. Okay. Uh, thank you, Ellie. 
Interesting anecdote. Carlos, <laughs> what about you? Carlos, you look so fancy. Te ves bien elegante. Gracias, teacher. Thank you. Okay, my friend, tell us. Okay. The fun, the fun intense thing is win and coaching, dressing a woman for life show and Facebook. What hey a kid of what the come dressing a woman and the head came in tang and a half team. Okay, um, a cousin dressed like a woman. Is yes. that okay? Tu primo se vestía de mujer. Okay, so yes. <laughs> well, it's for it was for Facebook post or it was a show. It was a it's, talent contest. Yeah. So ah, it's show. a show. Yes. Sí. Um, there are some shows, for example, Rosita Alvarez, uh, and some others like that. That men, it, it is common that men dress like woman. Los hombres se visten de mujer. And it's really funny. Or Pimpinela, for example. And there are some shows, right? Yes. Sí, como eso fue para la, para la pandemia, que se vistió así. Ah, era, okay. daba, daban premios por eso, ese show. Ajá. Did he win? Ganó? No. Yes. Wow. Sí, sí. That's, that's good. That's cool. Okay. Ahí en Maybe... otra clase lo, lo voy a buscar y lo voy a compartir ya. Okay. okay. That's okay, really okay. funny. I wouldn't do it. Yo quizás no lo hubiera hecho, but there are some people that they, they, they are like that. Son bien así, son bien extrovertidos, okay? No, so, pero era, 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 era pizza, teacher, era pizza. Oh, well, yes, food, food, everything for food. Todo por la comida. Nice, Carlos, okay. A mí se me hace que vos eras, Carlos, y estás diciendo que es tu primo, but good. No, teacher. No problem, no problem. You want pizza. Okay, and we have some others here. And let's see, Kenya, are you ready? Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. <laughs> hmm? okay. With my friends from the neighborhood, we play in the street, throwing throwing water balloons, bags of water, and even wet the house with we drill water at each other which in the end we eden up will bathe. Okay, so tirando vejiga con agua, okay, throwing mm -hmm. like balloons with, with, with water. And at the end, I didn't get the idea. What happened at the end? Because you were throwing and even on the walls, en las paredes, me imagino que chocaban, crash on the walls, right? Sí, tuvimos pequeños accidentes con la gente que pasaba también. <laughs> yes. <laughs> que también los terminamos bañándolo. <laughs> Ajá, okay. Accidentally, accidentally. Accidentally, sí. Okay. Y mi mam, y lastimosamente mi mami tenía que poner la cara por nosotros. Okay, <laughs> yes. She was like. Mm -hmm. Pero era bien divertido, la verdad, con los chicos de ahí, lo que sí. Okay. And if you notice the those um, games and plays or in those stories uh, don't happen again. Okay, it's like a period of time in your childhood, pero en tu en tu niñez. But uh, maybe there are few, quizás son pocas las veces que suceden eso, but really funny. Mm -hmm. And they don't what they don't happen again. Ya no pasan después. So, no, like good yeah, memories. Solo una vez pasa yeah, ella. that's it. Well, it's a yeah. good memory. Un buen recuerdo. Yeah, uh, sí, memory. sí. Y cuando los veo así de vez en cuando nos acordamos. Yeah, de you, you talk locuras. about it and you, <laughs> you, you laugh. Yes. yes. You no se ríe. Thank you, Kenia. Sí. Okay, okay, yes. Really good, the Kenia. Creo que era la que los organizaba. Okay, Kenia. Mm, no, no era yo. Uh -huh, Ellos uh -huh. comenzaban y yo terminaba bañándolo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, perfect. Okay, uh, what about if we listen to Luis? Are you ready, Luis? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Okay, teacher. Uh, uh, once they pinned my face while, while I sleep, uh, another time I was sitting in a chair and they tied my shoelaces. Okay. Okay, um, I didn't get it. I didn't get it very well. You were at home. Estabas en casa, right? Yes, yes. In your bedroom, en tu cuarto? No. Yes. 
Ajá. Yes. You Ajá. were seated. Eh, hey, you fell down. Y te caíste. Or what happened, actually? No, me pintaron la cara, teacher. Ah, you were painted. <laughs> With makeup, con maquillaje, makeup, or markers, o marcadores. Marker, marcador. Marcador. Okay. Yes. Well. Yes, teacher. Hey, did they take pictures? <laughs> what? Did they take pictures? No, teacher. No, that's good. Uh, and that, that's really positive for our generation and the previous generation. Because imagine if we had had, si hubiéramos tenido, if we had had cell phones, camera, and all those things, a lot of memories, un montón de recuerdos, videos. Y, y creo que no hubiéramos hecho muchas cosas. We, we wouldn't la, have done. La comparten, teacher. Ahorita así como está la tecnología. No se yeah. guardan nada. Yes, no, no. They show it on okay. different social media. Okay, mm -hmm. Luis. I'm so okay. sorry for you. You were the victim of painting. Okay, nice. Um, let's see. We have also here Wilfredo. What's going on with your eye? What happened? An accident. I see the evening, like... teacher. Good evening. ¿Qué te pasó? Uh, accident. Trabajo. Uh, Este me cayó como una basurita en el ojo. Tuve que, que ir por ahí el seguro de emergencia para ver qué me hacía. Ok, but are you all right? Pero estás bien. Sí, sí, sí. sí, sí. Yes. Ok, the eyes are delicate. Son bien delicados los ojos. El tema de, 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 de todo eso, bacterias, basuras. Eh, uno se puede lastimar, ¿verdad? Ahí. No, así que eh, ten cuidado. Yo pensé que... Sí. ¿Qué, ¿Qué en el trabajo te había sucedido? No, 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 en el camino, como vengo en la moto, me voló una basurita y... Ok, okay eh, Wilfredo, sí, ten cuidado, ese, y, y, y cuando, si quieres apagar la cámara un momento, o por lo menos para que no recibas tanta luz, porque un ojo está, está recibiendo todo. Sí, se siente, Toda la atención, se ¿verdad? Se siente, entonces, sí. Gracias, Ajá, entonces, teacher, gracias. Bueno, eso te pasa por portarte mal. No quiero decir, <risa> pero la esposa, the wife, I think... I think. <risa> She hit you, te golpeó ahí. A saber qué hiciste. Estaba para la pregunta de ayer, teacher. Yeah, es, ahí está, ahí está. Creo que lo escucharon. Ok, uh, let's listen. The last person for this. What about um, Wendy? Ok. <clears throat> Years ago, I was fighting with my brother and the older one told the little uh, and the older one told the little one to put Fanta soda in my hair. Okay. Fanta. A Coke like Fanta yes. in your hair. Hey, were you sleeping? Estaba durmiendo or no? No, no. Um, in my bed. Ah, the, you, you were in your bed. Okay. The, and, watching TV. Mm -hmm. Okay, and that 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 got like sticky. Te quedó pegajoso. No, no, no. No, tratamiento no. capilar. <laughs> okay. Well, no. <laughs> how old were you? ¿Qué edad tenías? Um, quiero ver. Sixteen. 16, you were a, a lady, ya era una señorita, 16 years old. Sí, ya, yeah. ya estabas ahí de, ¿cómo se llama? De, de maliciosa. Ok. <laughs> nice, Wendy. Things that happen, brothers and relatives usually do, do those things. Ok. Um, thank you, Wendy. Ok, we go now with ways to say, leave me alone. Forma de decir, déjame solo o déjame sola. O sea, que le den espacio, ¿ok? Creo que muy tarde te estoy diciendo esto, Wilfredo, but here we have some options. Tenemos un par de opciones acá. Give me a break. Stay away from me. Leave me in peace. Go away. Buzz up. Get off my back and let me be. Let me be, ¿ok? So here we have give me a break. Stay away from me. No stay. 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 Stay away from me. Leave me in peace. Peace. Como peace and love. Go away. No away. 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 Go away. Buzz off. 
get off my back, let me be. Okay. I'm going to give you time if you want to take notes and I'm going to check the attendance list. So say hello, if you listen to your name. Okay, Carlos, hello there. Okay. Nice. Con vos vamos a comenzar contigo. Vamos a comenzar ahora, Carlos. Ok, porque Alfredo Saldaña y Carlos Ramírez. Ok, ok, está bien, Ticha. Como okay. lo Carlos dijo, llevemos dos Carlos. Yes, no, el otro es Pinto, pero va manejando. Ok, he's okay, driving. Ok, está bien. Pese, Ticha. Ok. Pese, pese. No problem. Carito. Hello, teacher. Carito, are you having a party after the class? Because no, you, you look like if you were going out. Te ves como que si vas a hacer ahí como lista ahí para, para la acción. No. <risa> no, just sleep. <risa> ok. Ok, ok. Nice. And Edwin, do we have Edwin here? No. Ok. Eli. Present. Thank you. Steffi. Hi. Hello. Evelyn. I'm here. You're there, Gabriel. Hello, teacher. Hello, Gabriel. Duran. Present, teacher. Thank you. Okay. Yvette Figueroa. Present, teacher. Nice. Um, Jackie, no, Jackie. Kenya. Hello, teacher. Hello, Luis. Thank you for the respuesta que I'm here, dando. teacher. Hello. <clears throat> Mardo. I'm here. You are there. Thank you. Marvin, no Mayra. Okay. Oscar. I'm here, teacher. Good evening. Thank you. Good evening. Rosa. Uh, Nina. Hello, teacher. Hello, Nina. Wilfredo. So. And you have. Present, teacher. Thank you, Will. Um, Claudia, do we have Claudia? All right, not connected. Um, Wendy. I'm here. You're there, thank you. Okay, so here we have ways to say, leave me alone. Pick one and pronounce it. We're going to start with Wendy and then Oscar. Okay, Wendy, say one. Give me a break. Nice, Oscar and... <laughs> Nina. Stay away from me. Good. Stay. And Leave me in peace. Okay. Nice. And Yvette, Gabriel. Uh, go away. 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 Thank you. Uh, here we have Gabriel Duran. Give me a break. A break. Nice. Uh, Duran, Wilfredo. Let me be. Good. Wilfredo, Mardo. Uh, get off my back. Mm, okay, get off my back. Uh -huh. Mardo and Luis. That's off. Good. Luis and Carito. Stay away from me. Okay, stay. Carito, Kenya. Give me a break. Right, okay, Kenya, Evelyn. Get off my back. Get off my good. Um, Kenya, Evelyn, and Elisa. They're leaving me in pace. Good. Elisa, Carlos. Stay away from me. Good. Carlos, um, Steffi. Get my brain. Okay, wonderful. Yes, mm -hmm. Nice, let me be. Como la canción casi como The Beatles, let it be. Uh -huh. Pero aquí sería let me be. Let it be, déjalo ser, déjalo que pase. Entonces, let, let me be, déjame ser. Okay, déjame ser tranquilo. Okay. So, igual, give me a break. When we say a break, it's like a recess. Es como un receso, es como, como uh, okay, time, time out. Okay. Stay away from me, aléjate y el resto. Igual, leave me in peace. Esa se escucha un poquito más, más rude, un poquito más rudo. Leave me in peace, déjame en paz. But here I have some uh, ways to say leave me alone. Okay. 
Recuerden, esta palabra es o oh, way, o oh, way. Ok. ¿Qué significa lejos? Stay away. Uh, para los que vieron una de las películas de Shrek, uh, hay un mundo que se llama un país que se llama muy, muy lejano, entonces dicen far, far away. Far significa lejos. O sea que se traduciría como lejos, 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 pero en, en ese caso se, se traduce como muy, muy lejano. Far, far away, away. Ok, that's it. Ok, my friends, we continue now with some exercises about uh, the passive voice, something that we were studying yesterday. And uh, just to have like a feedback, here we have, he opens the door. Es una oración normal, pero la oración pasiva sería the door is opened by him, okay? The door is opened by him. Y pues recuerden que, remember that we have been studying the, let me, let me see. Okay. The past participle. Okay, past participle of the verbs. Aquí tenemos estos, ¿verdad? Que um, hemos estado utilizando que son estos. Past participle verbs. Regular. And here we have irregular. Past participle verbs. Que son los principales que hemos estado utilizando. Okay. So, nice. Now we go. With this, um, vamos a ver. Drown. Necesito que vean esta, la imagen, esta imagen, se las compartí en WhatsApp. Entonces, este, el verbo, por ejemplo, draw, aquí está, vamos a utilizar el pasado participio. Así que la mayoría de verbos están eh, en esa lista. No todos, pero sí la mayoría de estas oraciones. I need you to check the list. Necesito que revisen esa lista y vamos a realizar estos, um, these exercises, ¿ok? So, here we have this. Ok, so we're going to start with the first and I will need the help of Nina. Nina, and then we go with Carito. Está muy tranquilita, Carito. Goodness. Ajá. Uh -huh. Come on. What number? Uh, four. Four. Ajá. Uh -huh. I draw a picture. I draw a picture. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y la voz pasiva sería. Draw. Mm -mm. A picture. No. Ah. Ajá. A picture. Y luego el verbo to be, que sería. Is. Is. Y el verbo en participio, el participio de draw sería. Drew. Mm -mm. Drew. Ese, ese es el pasado simple. Quiero el participio, el que está en la otra columna. A drown. Drown. Mm -hmm. yeah. Ok. Mm -hmm. En lugar de a picture, podemos decir de a picture o the picture, ¿verdad? La, la, It's drown. It's drown. Mm -hmm. Como que okay. la pintura está dibujada. Ok. So, mm -hmm. o, o, mm -hmm. Así sucesivamente. We go now with Carito and then um, Luis. Number five. Number five. They wear blue shoes as uh, will be blue shoes are where? I don't know if it is regular or irregular. It's irregular. Mm -hmm. can, can you see it? Está por ahí. No, teacher, no. 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 Okay. I don't know what is the. It's irregular. Mm -hmm. Participle. It's irregular. Mm -hmm. Pero no está. Okay. Our war. War. Okay. Okay. Let's continue with Luis and then Gabriel. Okay. Teacher number seven. Seven. It does not is open in the book. Casi, casi. Mm -hmm. Fíjate aquí. En la uno, he opens the door. He doesn't open the book. Ajá. El objeto es the, the book. 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 Mm -hmm. book. The book. Y como es negativa, vamos a utilizar el verb be en negativo. The book. Mm -hmm. 
The book and does not. Is not. Ajá. Uh -huh. El verbo en participio. Open. That's it. Okay. Good. Okay. okay. Gabriel, okay. and then we go mm. with Kenya. Okay. Okay. Recuerden okay. que les he dicho siempre que es bueno anticiparse, ¿verdad? Siempre ver cuál podemos utilizar, ¿verdad? Para ya tener más o menos la idea. Y si no, yo les ayudo. As always. Number two. Number two. Number two. We set the table and we we set the no tenemos que comenzar con el objeto el objeto es the table the table uh -huh. ahora que va fíjate it, en los demás is is Set is, es de los verbos que el, me gustan, que no cambian. Set se parece a este. Se parece a hit, se parece a put. El se table parece. is set. El table is set. Lo que me gusta de esos verbos es que no cambian. Son irregulares y así son en, en presente pasado y pasado participio. The table okay. is set. Ok. Nice. We go now with Kenya and then Evelyn. Ok, teacher. Ok. The... Eight. Number eight. Mm -hmm. The letter mm, is no are are not. Ah, uh, sería is porque es singular. Ah, sí, 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 okay. No me invente is, que me. Ajá, uh -huh. is not. It's not. It's not down. Casi. El verbo es great. No. Ajá. No aparece ahí great. Ay, ay, sí, sí, sí. Que me estaba confundiendo con el do. Ah, ok. Ajá. Sería, the letter is not written. Uh -huh. The letter is not written. O sea, aquí dice, you don't write the letter. Tú no escribes la carta. Y aquí sería, la carta no está escrita. Uh -huh. Perfect. Okay, we go with. Um, oh, great. Uh, okay. No sé si es mi internet o el tuyo, Kenia. I don't know. Veo que está. No sé, yo también lo, lo escuché Entonces, así como cortado. Ok, Creo vamos. Que está fallando. Eh, A los dos los escuché cortados, por eso pensé que era el mío. Entonces. Pero también te el... escuché un poco. Se te está cortando. Ok. A Kenia le está cortando. Kenia. Yo creo que todo nos está fallando. Ok. Luis, ¿puedes Hola, escucharme? Teacher. Yo le escucho, pero sí, escucho teacher, que pero es cuando, cuando habla Kenia se oye como cortado. A usted lo oigo bien. Ok. Yo creo que Kenia, no sé, algo tiene, mujer. <ríe> algo está pagando. Okay. ok. Entonces voy a ver si me incorporo otra vez. Entonces. No problem, Kenia. Ok. Nice. Thank you. Uh, very good. Uh, we go now with Evelyn and then we go with um, Wilfredo. Okay, Evelyn. Three or six? Six. Okay, let's go with six. Um, they don't help, help me. Uh -huh, they don't help you. Mm -hmm. Ahora comenzamos con el objeto de la oración que sería you. Uh -huh. Bueno, vamos con el verbo to be. You. Ajá. ¿Qué verbo sería ahí? Help, help. Casi. Ajá, help va después, pero el verbo to be. En este you. caso. Sería are. Uh -huh. Como es you negativa. Are don't. Ajá, you, are you are not. Ajá. Y el verbo. Help. Yes. En pasado. You are not help. Okay. Good. Thank you. Really nice. Will, are you ready with number three? Uh, a lot of money. Yes. Mm -hmm. 
verbo to be? The are. Is? Is. is. Ahora, el pasado participio de pay. Pay. Sería pay. Pay. Es un irregular. Ok. Well, Bye. I guess. Thank you, Will. Now we are like uh, arriving. Creo que ya vamos llegando. Vamos aterrizando. Ok. And we here have some other um, exercises. Ok. Here we have the passive voice. Ok. Necesito que estos verbos, the verbs uh, which are in the, in the space and in este espacio, we have to change into the past participle. Necesitamos cambiarlo al pasado participio. Todos estos, ¿ok? Algunos están en la lista que les envía, otros pues ya los conocen y otros lo podemos investigar. Ok. Solo eso vamos a cambiar el verbo. So for this we're going to start with Carlos and then we go with Ellie. Ok, Carlos. Pick one. Ok, teacher. Uh, number two. Number two. The car is repaired. Ah, the... Como es plural, es plural, no decimos the car is. The car. The car. Uh, re... Is es plural. Is. Eh, perdón, is y singular. Vamos a plural que sería. Are. Are. Uh -huh. The car are. are rep repired. Yes. Se pronuncia repired. repaired. Is. Pero se quiere repired. Good. Okay. Thank you. Okay. And we go now with Ellie. And after Ellie, we go with Yvette. Ellie? Uh, number seven. Number seven. The cows. Oh, uh, no, no, no. O sería el anterior, uh, drive. No, no, el seven. Seven. The cows. Vamos con el verbo to be. Is. Mm, estamos hablando de vacas. Uh, Vaca es is. Pero, y es. Las vacas son. Feed, feed es alimentar. alimentar. Are they called feed? Sería aquí, fed. Mm -hmm. The cows are fed every morning. Mm -hmm. Fed es un, es un verbo irregular. Mm -hmm. fed, feed es alimentar y fed alimentado. Ok, mm -hmm. thank you. And we go okay. now, ok, we go with uh, Yvette and then we go with Duran. Ok. Um, Um, yo manejo sería um, undriven. Ok. Ajá, uh -huh. I am driven. Driven. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Nice. Ok, we go with Duran and after Duran we go with Mardo. Uh, number two, three. Ok. The kitchen is cleaned every day. It's cleaned every day. Perfect. Mardo, your turn. And after Mardo, we will have Oscar. Number. No. Eight. Eight. Okay. The shop. The shop is closed by, ma by the manager. Yes, la tienda está cerrada por el gerente. Perfect. Okay, Oscar. And then Carito. Okay, teacher. What number? Uh, ten. Okay, let's go with number 10. Sí, que el mensaje está cayendo ahí de que no me deja ver la pregunta. Ok, no problema. Ahora es la Ok, eh, the president are elected yes. by the people. By. By the people. Thank you. 
elected by the people. Okay, good. And here we have Carito, and then we go back with Luis. Um, number nine. I Number. take it to the hospital every week. I'm sorry, could you repeat again, please, Carito? I sorry. take it. Mm -hmm. I, 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 I am I am taken to the hospital. Taken. Yes, taken. Uh, de hecho, hay una película que se llama Búsqueda Implacable y creo que es taken. Taken es como tomado, raptado. Okay, so that's it. Okay, so, aunque. Aunque realmente kidnap significa um, secuestrar. Secuestrar. Kidnap es secuestrar. Ok. So kidnap, secuestrado. Es un verbo regular. So that's it. Thank you, Carito. Really good. Luis, we go with Luis. And uh, to finish, we go with Wendy. Ok. Teacher number four. Number four. Many, many two is produce. Ah, many tools, plural, plural. Tool um, es uno. Tools, many. Uh -huh. Many tools. Many tools are produce. El verbo no se... hmm? Produce. Produce. From plastic. Produced from plastic. Thank you. Okay. Wendy, and to finish, uh, Evelyn. Ten. Ten is taken. You can select one ah, and, okay. and five. Mm. Spanish is a spoke. Yes. In many countries. Okay, Wendy. Spanish. Spanish. Yes. Spanish. Uh -huh. Spanish is spoken in many countries. El español es hablado en muchos países. Yes, perfect. Mm -hmm. ¿Por quién es hablado? Por muchos latinos, okay? But Spanish is spoken. Es lo principal. Thank you. Evelyn, can you help me with paper? Number five. The, the paper. The paper. The paper make from wood. Falta el verbo to be. The paper. The, the paper. Is. Is made from wood. Ajá, que el papel está hecho de eh, madera, digamos. ¿Verdad? Tomado. Ok. Thank you very much. Uh, we are advancing. Vamos avanzando con, con este tema de passive voice. No es nada fácil. Believe it. It is not easy. But you are understanding little by little. Ya lo van captando poco a poco. No es fácil. Nada que ver como, como los otros, ¿qué? Los otros estructuras gramaticales. Eso ya es un poquito más avanzadito. Ok. Adjectives, comparative and superlative. Yesterday, we were talking about comparative adjectives and you were creating some sentences. You were comparing, estuvieron comparando uh, people, you were comparing objects, ¿verdad? Entonces tenemos esto. Now, we're going to use superlatives. Ahora vamos a usar superlativos, algo que sobresale. Something that is like, um, something that is very special, como que algo bastante especial, por ejemplo, for example, here we have uh, the funniest, como la, peli la película, la pregunta que, le que estábamos respondiendo, the funniest, lo más chistoso, lo más gracioso, tenemos the oldest, lo más viejo, the saddest, lo más triste, uh, the, what, the youngest, lo más joven, o el más joven, the angriest, el más enojado, Okay, the worst, el peor. Okay, the bravest, el más valiente. Okay. Um, así que necesito que hagamos oraciones con eso. Yo voy a hacer una. Of course, I'm going to create one so you can have an idea. Aquí solo, here we have, or we need only one subject. Solo necesitamos un sujeto. In comparative, we need two. En el comparativo necesitábamos dos para estar comparando dos. En este solo necesitamos uno. Okay, for example, 
Uh, Will Smith is the most famous. Is the most famous actor. Okay, todos sabemos por qué famoso. So, Will Smith is the most famous actor. Sencillo. Okay. Entonces, o oh, podemos decir en lugar de acto, is the most famous in movies. Okay. Podemos hacerlo de las dos maneras. Will Smith is the, mo is the most famous in movies. Es el más famoso en las películas o de las películas. Or Will Smith is the most famous actor. Sencillo. Okay. So you can look for a place. Si hay un lugar que a ustedes les gusta, pueden utilizar modern. Pueden utilizar, um, por aquí estaba, cheapest, el más barato. You can talk about food. Pueden hablar de comida. Okay. Um, the most beautiful. Si hay una actriz o, 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 o presentadora, or a journalist, una reportera, do you consider it the most beautiful? Okay. The most attractive. You can talk about actors. Pueden hablar de actores. ¿Quién consideran que es el más atractivo o la más atractiva? Of course, you can say it. Okay. The name, así igual que ese, Will Smith is the most famous. Pueden utilizar otro nombre. And is the most attractive. Okay. Uh, the angriest, si consideran que alguien o en su familia es más enojado, my brother, puede ser uh, my nephew, uh, kindest, el más amable. Pueden hablar de actores si quieren. There are some actors who are kind and there are some others that are angry. Hay actores que son amables and there are some others uh, who are angry with the fans, con los fanáticos, son bien pesados, like rude, ok, uh, the most modern, si va en lugar de lugares, ok, the happiest, el más feliz, ok, the silliest, el más tonto, ok, so, um, I guess, the most wonderful, el más maravilloso, there are a lot of options, ok, so you can say one sentence, think on one, piensen en uno, Carito, can you help us, and then we go with Yvette, Okay, I am the most attractive Colombian girl. Oh, yes, of course, my dear Carito. <laughs> Good, Carito. And even Carito told the last time that you have like a relative who is Miss Colombia or something like that, right, Carito? Or she participated in some contest like that, like that. Creo que con, mm, familia oh, yes. participó. Um... Cousin, I guess. I, sí, I Sofía guess. Vergara, familia de, de Carito. No, 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 no. Quieren, no. quieren, quieren, ok. No, but yes, Carito said that. So it means that in your family. Yes, if, uh, like, Laura Barjun, he, she was in Miss Colombia and le, then she was the second woman more beautiful in the world. Oh, the, ok. Won the el premio, como siempre, el Miss Universo, pero. Ok, aquí sería the second most beautiful. The second most beautiful, yes. The most, ajá, porque more es como que está comparando, pero como que la segunda más, más bonita. Yes, Carito fue Miss Colombia. Lo que pasa es que usted no se acuerda. She, uh, she was in the competition with Milena Mayorga and all those. Yes, remember, okay. right, Carito? Absolutely. <laughs> Good, Carito. That's the attitude. Ok, we go now with Yvette and then Mardo. Ok, Yvette. Okay, um, my dog is the most fat. The fattest. El the... más gordito. Yes. Okay, the fattest. <laughs> Acuérdense que vamos a utilizar estos. Yes. Okay, ah, your okay. dog. Okay. Come bien, come bien tu perrito. Okay. <laughs> yes. Sí, sí, está bien gordito. <laughs> wow, okay, that's good, that's good. Así nos tienen a todos nosotros. Okay, Mardo, and then we go with Ellie. Julia Roberts is the most attractive actress. Yeah, really good. Julia Roberts is the most attractive actress. Nice. We go now with Ellie and then Luis. Uh, the most, the lead Schindler, the saddest. The saddest, okay. The uh, saddest. The list of children is the saddest movie. Movie. It's the saddest movie. Es la película como más triste. Yes. I love the end. Well, I love sad movies. Me gustan las películas tristes. Well, in my case. But it's really hard, the story. La historia es muy, muy, muy bien dura. Esa historia, okay. 
Nice. And we go now with Luis and then Oscar. Teacher, yo quiero, yo tengo una pequeña duda, teacher. Yes. Ahí donde mencionó the most modern, yeah. más moderno. Usted se refirió a lugares, pero eso también podríamos utilizarlo para objetos. Of ¿verdad? course, of course. You can talk about technology devices. Ah, puede sí. hablar de, de, de tecnología, of course, definitely. Yes. Porque yo le he puesto y le he puesto my computer is much modern in my workplace. Oh, nice. So it means that your computer is the top, right? The top in your workplace. Okay. So that's nice. Good. And it's good to have technology devices. Para tener dispositivos buenos, the best. Now, una buena compra. Oscar, and then we go with Evelyn. The country, the Dubai is most modern. Okay, Dubai is the most modern country. Okay, nice opinion. Evelyn, and then we go with Wendy. Uh, Adele is the most beautiful than uh, Shakira, for example. Okay, good, good. But it's a good example. Adele is more beautiful. Si decimos more beautiful than Shakira, estamos comparando. Ok, that's it. Um, Pero aquí podemos utilizar esto. Adele is... The most beautiful. Singer. La cantante más bonita. And even... Mm -hmm, ok, nice. I love Adele because she changed, but her voice is the same. La voz la mantiene. Really nice voice. Yes. And now she, she looks attractive, of course, definitely. Thank you, Evelyn. We go now with Wendy and Duran. Ok. Hachiko... Is the most saddest movie. Ok, aquí solo sería the saddest, ¿verdad? The Porque saddest. utilizamos okay. most con los adjetivos que son más largos. Con los que son cortos, solo utilizamos ah, the saddest. saddest. Yes. The ah, chico, is, is really the sad. Most. It's really sad, yes. Especially when he, the, the ha, chico, is waiting for his friend. Está esperando a su amigo. And, well, nice Cry. movie. <laughs> yes, it's really sad. It's really sad, ok. Okay, uh, thank you. Very nice sentence. Duran. Oh, my aunt, the angriest in my family. <laughs> my aunt is the angriest in my family. Todos, todos, every family has a grumpy. Todos tienen un gruñón en la familia. Every family has a grumpy. Yes, that's it. Nadie lo puede negar, okay? So in your case, is 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 like your your aunt. Okay, we go now with Nina and then uh, Gabriel. The flu is the worst for me. Okay, yeah, the flu, la gripe. Mm. Yeah. Yes, it's kind of difficult and disgusting because yes. you, you cannot work very well with the flu. No, no. You're not no. active. Yes. I agree. Estoy de acuerdo. Okay, we go with Gabriel and then Pinto. Okay. Uh, El Ibaldo is funnier than Oscar. Okay, good. Thank you. Bien, aquí estás comparando, Gabriel. Okay. Dan, pero aquí vamos a usar the superlative. Okay. Hmm? Entonces, si vas a utilizar funnier, vas a utilizar mejor the funniest. Ok, Elibaldo. The funniest. Is the funniest. Es el más chistoso. Elibaldo is, is the funniest. Is the funniest. Is the funniest. Okay, hasta Oscar. ahí. No, no, hasta ahí. Es que, okay, no. Aquí solo sería Elibaldo is the funniest. Elibaldo es el más chistoso. Ok. Así okay. sería. No problem. Ok, we go now with Pinto and then Wilfredo. Okay, teacher. I am the newest student in this classroom tonight. Oh, yes, that's it. In this class, you're the newest. Definitely. Okay, my friend. Well okay. said. And we go now with Wilfredo and Carlos. Uh, my boss is the angriest. <laughs> okay. The boss is the angriest. Tu jefe el más enojado. Vaya. Ya va a ver este video. No, quieren. No. I'm, I'm kidding. Estoy bromeando. Well, we all have had an 
and grumpy boss. Todos hemos también tenido un jefe gruñido. That's part of the life, parte de la vida. Okay, Carlos, your turn, and then we we'll go with Edwin. Okay, my go, my go is happy. Um, the Romero is the Romero the the happy happiness. Ok, ok. Estás hablando de happy, estás hablando de un lugar, de una persona. I'm sorry, I didn't hear. Este, eh, no, happy, o sea, es más feliz. No, o sea, pero no estamos comparando. Tienes que utilizar the happiest. O sea, ayer estábamos happy. comparando. Ayer decíamos ajá. happier than. Aquí solo tienes que decir. Ah, okay. Ajá. Ah, ok. Entonces, my head is... Bueno, no comparar, ¿verdad? Okay, okay. Solo the happiest, ¿ok? The happy, the happiest. Hasta ahí. Uh, no problem, the happiest. Bueno, ahora sí. Yes, no problem. Edwin, your turn. Okay, okay. Then we continue. Ok. <clears throat> my older sister is the angriest in my family. Ok, good, in my family. That's es lo que estamos hablando. Every, every family has a grumpy, yes. You can't deny it. No lo pueden negar. Thank you. Okay, very good sentences. Now we continue with this. Ya hablamos de los superlatives. What is the funniest thing some friends or relatives have done? Vamos a ver. In this case, I would like to listen to Duran. Are you ready for this question? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Okay, please. Okay. Oh, I got to the party in Honduras. We went for three days and returned in uh, 16 days to El Salvador. We got no almost um, all Honduras and drag beers and from party to party. <laughs> Good. Okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, that's y nice. Y vamos por tres días y regresamos en 15. Okay, good. <laughs> plans always change. Los planes siempre cambian. Yes, so that happens. But good, you have a... I guess Barena is one of the beers is very common in, in Honduras. Really good. Okay. Yeah. So nice. And you have like a lot of fun. Interesting. Como que pasó ayer, ¿verdad? Okay. <laughs> Hangover. Interesting, Duran. Thank you. Now let's listen to uh, Mardo. Are you ready? Yes, yeah, teacher. Please, my friend. The funniest thing some friends or relatives have done is a smoke cigarette at Christmas with my friends. We were 10 years old. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes, that, that's something that happens, especially when we are kids. We are trying to feel what happens. Siempre intentamos saber qué se siente, right? So. 10 years old, estaba muy joven, Marto. Ok, come yeah, on. Yeah, yeah. Siempre ha sido malía. Yeah. Ok, thank you. We <laughs> go now with Nina. Can you tell us about the funniest thing of some friends or relatives? Ok, I'm trying to. Ok, go. To say, well, times ago, when I stay in the school, uh, when finish the class, with the walk walk on the street with my classmate and then um, push the doorbell 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 push the doorbell and run away oh and waiting for the people open the door okay, and to see then the people close the door again doorbell you pull the bell el timbre it was funny for us yeah every day made the, the same okay and did you ever fall down? ¿Alguna vez te caíste? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes. <laughs> ya ves, yeah. Yo castiga sin azote. Yeah, that happens. <laughs> that happens. Okay, good. It's part of the 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 
de tricks, como trucos, travesuras que yeah. uno hace de yeah. niño. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's really common. Que es como mardo, mm -hmm. pero este mardo se fue al extremo. Ya. Yeah. Navidad ni respetó la Navidad este mardo. Thank you, Nina. Really good. Okay. Eh, 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 jefe, eh, jefe, eh, teacher, jefe, lo hacíamos yeah. para, lo, lo hacíamos para, para encender lo, lo, los cuetillos, los yeah. cohetes. Ah, los cohetes. Ajá, ajá. Pero solo en Navidad, solo en Navidad. No, claro, respetando la Navidad, como siempre. A ver si no te fumaste un silbador. Ok, so well, nice. Nice, Mardo. Ya quedó en el pasado, no le diremos a nadie. What if we listen to Carito que tiene calor? Ok, Carito. A ver, ¿qué tienes para nosotros? Piche, le fallé hoy. ¿Por qué? A ver. Dear teacher, this day my new room was blocked. I can't remember any funny moment from friends or family, really? at least not a decent one. Really? But the important thing is to participate and improve vocabulary. That's the objective. I'm so sorry. <laughs> okay, so no, no stories, no anecdotes. No, teacher, I don't remember nothing decent. Okay, nothing decent. But the point here is not nothing decent. But no. it's okay. It's okay, Carito. No, no, quiere contar. no, okay, no problem, Carito. Relax. I know you have good memories and innocent memories. Okay, so no problem, Carito. Tú siempre participas y ya te vas a acordar de algo. Ya vas a ver antes de que termine la clase. I know you're going to tell me something. Okay, and in here we go with Evelyn. Are you ready with this question? Sorry, teacher. I don't know. I don't prepare. You don't, you don't have funny things with friends or relatives? No. No. <laughs> okay. I, I, I don't remember. You don't remember. Everything was very innocent. Todo era tranquilo e inocente. Okay. <laughs> no problem. Okay. We continue. And look at this. Here we have empathy, responsibility, honesty. Como una canción de Billy Joel, creo que así se llama. Innovation. Loyalty, leadership, punctuality, punch, como punch, como punctuality, no puntuality, punctuality, efficiency, efficiency, integrity, respect, no respect, respect, empathy, responsibility, honesty, innovation, loyalty, leadership, punctuality, efficiency, efficiency. Integrity, respect. Okay. Tell me one carito and then pinto. Uh, responsibility. Good. Pinto, Eli. Loyalty. Nice. Uh, Elisa, Nina. Me perdí, teacher. Okay, no problem. Así nos perdemos todos en la vida. Okay, Nina and then Wendy. Loyalty. Loyalty. Ah, está copiando el Nina. No. Ok. Ajá. No. Ok. Uh, we go with Wendy and Luis. Leadership. Leader. Quiero ver si me está inventando. Leadership. Ah, no. Leadership. Ahí está. Yes, yes, yes. Ok. No problem. Luis and Edwin. Efficiency. Efficiency. Good pronounced. Good. Edwin, Oscar. Eh, teacher, no really much. No viste la imagen, ok. No problem. Oscar. Integrity. Integrity. Good. Wilfredo. Punctuality. Punctuality, bien. Tiene superpoderes de Will. Ok, we go with Mardo. And Gabriel. Honesty. Honesty, ok. Pensé que me iba a decir, honestamente, no sé. Eh, Gabriel en Carlos. Leadership. Leadership. Ah, estás copiando, Leadership. Gabriel. Ok. Ok. And we go with Carlos. Punctuality. Punctuality. Ok. No me dijeron empathy. Y me respect. dijeron. Respect. 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 Okay. O oh, ya estuvo, Gabriel, no estoy inventando. Ok. <laughs> Okay, so here we have some of this and look at this. 
Here we have, um, a ver si se puede ver. Vamos a ver. The point here is that. Ok, values at work. Tenemos los valores eh, en el trabajo, ok. So in this, uh, you can see, just give me a second. So, Let me see here. I have some problems with this. Okay, okay, no problem. A ver si podemos ver acá. Tenemos empathy, responsibility, honesty, innovation, loyalty, leadership, punctuality, efficiency, efficiency, integrity, respect. And here we have down. Eh, esto se le llama puzzle. Puzzle es crucigrama, ¿verdad? Entonces, down are this. One, five, three, two. Those are down. And across are this, like vertical. Okay. Tenemos los verticales que son para abajo y las horizontales que son arruinados, okay? So, um, let's see. El problema es que es tanto difícil verlas uno por uno. Okay, but. Here we have, like, the definitions, like, the content. And you tell me, y me dicen, cuál considera si, si pueden captar uno, okay? Look at this, look at the description. And see, for example, number one, down. Que estaría acá, down. Be, being faithful to your friends, family, and principles. Ser fiel a uh, tus amigos, familia, y principios. Mm -hmm. Okay, Durán, yeah? Number five. And number five. Okay, let me see. Number five. Okay. Yes. Uh, can you read this? The introduction. The introduction of the new ideas. Ideas, new ideas. Ideas. Uh -huh. uh, methods or inventions. Mm -hmm. oh, okay, you no, say innovation. innovation. Number five, down, verdad? Five, innovation, innovation. Okay. Excellent. Okay, who else? Thank you, Duran. Teacher. Hmm? Number nine. Number nine. What do we have in number nine? Puntuality. Can you read the, the, the what? Eh, pod podrías leer las, ¿cómo se llama? Okay. Um, a reading or being done exactly the time that has Please. been arrived. Okay, arriving or being done exactly the time. Llegar exactamente el tiempo que ya estaban, ¿verdad? Ajá. Uh -huh. You say that it, that is what? Punctuality. Punctuality. Yes, punctuality. Here we have punctuality. Yes. Okay. Thank you. And uh, here we have Carito and Pinto. Okay, Carito. Picture the number seven. It's done. Ah, uh, ah, uh, uh, I'm sorry. Es que como estoy moviendo esto. Estoy moviendo the esto. Uh -huh. Ah, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Ah. Because I'm, I'm moving because of the screen. Como que no se ve bien. Estoy tratando de... de, de. Mm -hmm. Ah, okay. Uh, number seven. Mm -hmm. Being honest. Unfair and behaving according to the moral principle that you believe in. Uh -huh. It integrity. Integrity. Seven down. Okay. Seven, seven integrity. down. Yes. Integrity. 
Ok, ya tenemos integrity, tenemos innovation. ¿Y qué otra me dijeron? Number five. No, me dijeron punctuality. punctuality. Yes, thank you. Ok, we go with Carlos, with Pinto, and then Carlos, and then Eli. Ok, Pinto, you go. Ok, the number eight. Number eight, yes. The ability to understand how someone feels because you can imagine what is like to be them. To be them, good pronunciation. What do you think it is? This is empathy. Definitely it is empathy. And that's part of emotional intelligence. Es parte de la inteligencia the emocional. Mind. The ability to understand, okay? Ponerse en los zapatos de, del otro, okay? To put in another's uh, shoes, in another no, step. No, okay. Shoes. Perfect. Well pronounced. Carlos and then Eli. Yeah, Carlos. Number three, teacher. Number three, yes. Do English commently, commenting with an effectively we want what time, money and energy. Okay. Efficient. Efficiency. 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 En la segunda sílaba. Yes. Hacer algo okay. e effectively without wasting time, sin gastar dinero y tiempo. Efficient. Okay, good one. Ellie, your turn. And if we have some other Teacher, uh, volunteers. Teacher, una consulta. Yes. Loyalty, ¿qué significa? Eh, lealtad. Lealtad. Mm -hmm. Okay, sería number 10. Number 10. Mm -hmm. The quality of being fair and truth, truthful. Oh. Eh, Ok. Eh, ok. And the, here we have. Mm -hmm. The quality of being fair and truthful. Mm -hmm. La and cualidad truthful. de ser justo. Justo y confiable. Mm -hmm. Honesty. Ok, honesty. And here we have who else? Who else? Maybe we can have Luis, Gabriel. Ya pasé, teacher, pero quiere. Ok, pero quiere <laughs> otra vez. No, quiero ver. Ok, check a look. Teacher, me escucha. Yes. Puedo decir una. Kenia, ¿Te Kenia, ¿qué pasa? Tal vez no sé. A Kenia le escucho, le escucho como mi voz de mi interior, de mi conciencia. Así como que, ok. Yes, Kenia. Bien renovada. Sí, bien renovada esta Kenia. Sí. Yo trato de... Ajá, ajá. Tirando okay. agua. Dale. <risa> eh, two. Ajá. The belief that sometimes or someone should not be Hermit. Treated. Treated. Brutally. La creencia uh, de que algo no debe ser tratado así con lastimándolo o de manera ruda. Uh -huh. What is that? Respect. Respect. Definitely respect. it is respect. Respect others. Okay. Not treated. No lastimar a nadie. Thank you, Kenya. Very okay. well done. Okay. okay. We are number one. Four, six. Four, teacher. Okay, four, Gabriel. Four. Being good at leading, leading, leading a group organ, organi, organization. Organization country. Hmm? What is that? Leadership. Leadership. Liderazgo. Leadership. Okay. We have number one and number six. Okay, number one. Uh -huh. Being faithful to your friends, family, principles, and so forth. Loyalty. Okay. Loyalty. And that's it. That's it. Perfect. And the last one, uh, the quality of being dependable. That's responsibility. Good. Very well done, my friends. We continue with this. Okay. 
correct for mistakes related to infinitives. Acuérdense que los infinitivos son los que llevan el to, ¿verdad? El to y el verbo, ¿ok? Um, let's check here. Any ideas? ¿Se acuerdan de lo de los infinitives? Que va un verbo, por ejemplo. I like to work at night. Por ejemplo, I like to work at night. Ahí el infinitive es to work. ¿Verdad? Ok. So, can we find uh, some, some mistakes, errores? Errores acá. Yes, Carito. In the number one, the company is mission is to distribute in top quality of its suppliers that uh, distribute blah, 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 distributing those um, right ENG because the two is the infinitive mm -hmm. or no? Totally to agree. Yeah. Distribute, yes. Se, distributing, bien rara esa, esa, esa verbo, distributing is distribute. First mistake, well, well done, Carito. Okay, what about the rest? Can you Teacher find? Number, number five. Number five. Rex, ambition to become the number one manufacturer of the other four kids. To become. Not to becoming, yes. And the correct answer um, is to become yes similar to carito no ing no i e n g i right no no it's not necessary thank you luis okay uh, two more no de two more sino que dos más two more mm -hmm. uh, oscar okay oscar go ahead the number two. Number two. Uh, our vision is the become the leaders in the telecom sector. Uh -huh, the telecommunication sector. What do you sector. consider is the mistake? The leaders. Mm, casi, casi. Oh. Ay, hay un error. There is a mistake, of course. Pero el error sería it. este. Ajá, it. Simplemente sería. Ok. Good. Yes. And thank you, Oscar. What about three and four? There's one more mistake. Un error más. Can you find it? Pueden encontrarlo. Okay. Hi, teacher. Okay, Wendy, try. Let's go. Uh, uh, four. 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 Uh, our goal is be recognized as the number one dairy producer. The mm -hmm. mistake? Error, the fake is, is B. Okay. Mm -hmm. Recognizes. Uh -huh. uh, puede ser is recognized. O puede ser uh, is go to. to be recognized. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ok. Thank you. Very nice, my friends. Sé que este tema no está un poco tan fácil, pero nos quedan 45 minutos y vamos pues, a ir avanzando. Uh -huh. Ok. Use the words in the box to write sentences about your responsibilities at work. Mm -hmm. Entonces vamos a tener, a tener acá. Necesitamos que hacer dos oraciones. Only two sentences. Pueden utilizar esta o esta o esta o esta o esta. Ok. I'm in charge of. Estoy encargado de. I'm in. I'm in charge of. Of. Aquí va un, una palabra con ing. Of checking. The products. Un ejemplo, I'm in charge of checking the products, ok. Um, en este caso, I'm sorry. Ok. 
Okay. And here we have be committed to. Yo estoy comprometido. I am committed to. Estoy comprometido to send reports every week, every Sunday. Okay. I am dedicated to. Todo, si se dan cuenta cuando ve el be, quiere decir que ustedes van, van a escribir I am. Okay. I am in charge of. I am committed to. Estoy. Eh, pues eh, en, en, en este tema de comprometido, I am dedicated to, dedicated, dedicated to, I am responsible for, I am res, responsible for the selling, para, por las ventas, I'm responsible for the, for the uh, customer service, ok, eh, y todo eso, ok, and in this case, you can select only two, solo pueden seleccionar dos, ok, And the second one. Y también, bueno, por lo menos estas últimas se parecen. Be responsible for y be accountable for. Estoy, soy responsable de. Soy responsable de. Ok. So that's it. Ok. Just give me a second. Me están llegando unas actualizaciones ahorita. So it is not time. Okay, please, I need you to, uh, you can make two sentences. Okay, I'm going to ask, le voy a dar un minuto. You can complete it. Okay, I am in charge of, I am committed to, I am dedicated. Okay. Esa es la pronunciación. Mire, la T, si va una, hay una T y hay una, una vocal, se pronuncia la T como R en inglés. Dedicated, dedicated, ok. Y las demás ahí están. Ok. Church. I am in church. I am committed. Committed. I am dedicated. Dedicated. Ok. So. Tell us about this. Ok. Mm, we can start maybe with Pinto. And then Eli. Okay, Pinto, go ahead. Tell me one of your responsibilities or things that you are in charge of at work. Okay, teacher, I have two responsibilities. I am I am in charge of to receive of our customer. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. And second, I be committed to bring an excellent attention. Okay, I am committed. I am committed. Mm -hmm. I am committed. Yes. Ok, interesting jobs. Muy interesante, interesting jobs. Ok, Eli, your turn, thank you. Eli, and then we go with Luis. Eli, are you ready? Yo, mi teacher, no le escuché que mi hijo venía a trabajar y tuve que ir a abrir la puerta. Ok, no hay problema, ¿verdad? Entonces tú puedes escribir una oración que, en la que estás a cargo de algo. Por ejemplo, I am in charge of, estoy uh, a cargo de, y te sigues una función de tu trabajo, ¿ok? I'm going to give you time. Ok, Luis, and then Carito. Um, I am dedicated to Kyle Customer. Dedicated, ok, good. Carito and Oscar. Hey teacher, uh, I am responsible to train the personal in quality. I am in charge to make the annual inter audit. Okay, excellent. So look at I am responsible for training. Okay. For training. Okay. I'm responsible. 
Thank you. For training. Siempre que va el for, vamos un verbo con ing que es el, el gerundio. Ajá. Y yo siempre pensé responsible porque va esta i acá y porque no va una responsible. But, ok. Esta palabra siempre me confundió. Interesting job. I like training. So you are in, in charge of receiving new, new employees and to train them. Tienen buen coach ahí. Excelente. Thank you, Oscar. And then we go with Evelyn. Okay, teacher. I am be in charge in charge of the loading Arian song. Okay, I am in chairs. No, I am B. I am in chairs. Mm -hmm. Interesting jobs you have. Okay, who's next? Uh, I am become. I am be the delicado too. Okay, vaya, Oscar. No podemos decir I am B. I am, o sea, en lugar okay, del B, okay. utilizamos el am. Mm -hmm. I am, I am. Okay. Good. Uh, Eli, and after Eli, we go with Carlos. I am chair on of taking orders in in Anda. Oh wow! Mm -hmm. Very well, uh, Carlos, and then Nina. Okay, I am contable for for my study study. Okay. And Nina, and then we go with Gabriel. I am responsibly for training my child. Okay, for training, for training. Training my child. Nice. Oh, uh, Oz, I know Gabriel, and then Duran. I am res I am responsible respons responsible, responsible responsible for the shipping department. Oh, well, good. Good function. Okay, Duran, and then we go with Wilfredo. Uh, I am responsible for training the new entry staff in the factory. Oh, similar to Carito, okay? So you are training, okay? And that's really uh, exciting, okay? Yes, exciting, but it's tiring. También es cansado. I know it's tiring, yes. Well, um, let me see. También estuve trabajando en esa área. I was working. Sí, in a similar area. Okay. We have now, ¿quién había dicho? Will and then Evelyn. I am dedicated to my goal. Okay, I am dedicated to? Dedicated to my goal. Eh, no capto lo último. Dedicated to? Goal. Work, trabajar. Work, trabajar. Okay, to work in in transportation, for example, get it to work in different areas. Okay, Evelyn and Wendy. No sé si ha pasado Wendy. Okay, Evelyn. I am in, in charge of preparing the work package. Ah, okay. And I am responsible for quotation the work, work package. Ah, the work package. Okay, very nice. And we go with Wendy and Yvette. Okay. Um, I am in chair, chair of checking the food packaging. Okay. Hola. Um, Oh. Okay. I I be responsible. No. I hola. Okay. I am I am responsible. I, I am responsible advertising the hmm. for the advertising the brand. Okay, thank you. Uh, Yvette, and then we go with Mardo. I am a counter for the audit. Ah, okay. For the auditory, could it be? And very nice, yeah, Yvette. 
Ardo. Ok. I am, I am responsible to buy of materials. Materials. Ok. Materials. Kenya. Hello, teacher. Ok. Are you ready? I am responsible for carrying, carrying cardex from the right material. Oh, raw materials. Nice. Ok, thank you. Veamos acá. Eh, yo sé que cuando aparece el B, les está diciendo que van a utilizar cualquiera de las tres formas del verbo to be. For example, we can use am, is, are. Ok. Those are the three forms of verb be. Son las tres formas del verbo to be. Eh, pero en ningún momento podemos utilizar she be o I be, ¿ok? Es diferente cuando decimos I will be, ¿verdad? Pero eso ya es diferente, pero uh, un, su, un sujeto o un sustantivo con el be mm -mm, tiene que ser am, is, are, ¿ok? Uh, we go now to the listening part, ¿ok? Be ready with your pen, pencil. I'm going to uh, present an audio. So be ready to write uh, words, sentences. So here we go. Aquí vamos. Music and its importance. Okay, I'm sorry, I have a problem. Just give me a second. Okay, I'm sorry. Now, here we go. Music and its importance. Music is an excellent company in our leisure time as it wipes away the feeling of boredom. It is proven to have re-energizing and rejuvenating abilities for us. It has not only been used to discard boredom, but too many have also made it their profession. Ample job opportunities are available in the music industry, starting from singing to creating music with the skill of playing instruments. Okay, let's listen again. One more time. Music and its importance. Music is an excellent company in our leisure time as it wipes away the feeling of boredom. It is proven to have re-energizing and rejuvenating abilities for us. It has not only been used to discard boredom, but too many have also made it their profession. Ample job opportunities are available in the music industry, starting from singing to creating music with the skill of playing instruments. Okay, so now you told me. Okay, volunteers. Carito, and then Ellie. Okay, uh, music, important time, pre prevent, excellent company, company, feelings, energizing, ability, burden to many profession available, create instrument for us, uh, opportunities and industry. Wow, a lot of words, nice. Um, Ellie? 
Okay. Music and it's important. Music excellent to weigh energies uh, that too many instruments profession. Mm, very well done. Um, some other words for the rest of uh, students? Do you have some others? Mardo? Um, yes, play instrument. Okay, play an instrument. Thank you, Rosa. Uh, Oscar, mm, music, Carlos, Mardo. Mm -hmm. Music and excellent company, opportunity, instrument, so, so okay okay that, that's good okay uh, oscar and carlos do you have some others okay In ability border may music with excellent company emergency new new many uh, orders play instrument mm. very nice what about Carlos? Okay, teacher. Music, important, excellent company, evolution, profession of play. Okay, nice. Okay, my friend. Very well done. Let's listen one more time. And now, here we have the text. Tenemos aquí el texto. So you can, um, you can check. Music and its importance. Music is an excellent company in our leisure time as it wipes away the feeling of boredom. It is proven to have re-energizing and rejuvenating abilities for us. It has not only been used to discard boredom, but too many have also made it their profession. Ample job opportunities are available in the music industry, starting from singing to creating music with the skill of playing instruments. So in this case, here we have music and its importance. When we say leisure time, significa al tiempo libre, okay? Leisure time is when you have free time. So you can have like uh, some hobbies or on the weekends, if you have free time, so leisure time, okay? Uh, boredom, que es aburrimiento, okay? Re-energizing, es como re-energizante, okay? In, an energizing could it be like Red Bull or some other drinks, but that's kind of drinks, but we have so re-energizing um, through music. Ok, nice. Recuerden que cuando quieran participar y todo, me levantan la manita del emoji, ¿verdad? Para que tengamos pues más orden y todo eso. Ok. Here we have two words. Personal versus personal. Personal versus personal. Ok. Which word means belonging to a particular person? Ok. Belonging to a particular person and the other which words means people who work for a company okay two definitions como dos definiciones cuáles consideran ustedes this definition goes with this or this definition goes with this okay opinions belonging to a particular person people who work for a company Personal versus personal. Okay. Miss Zuniga, what do you think? I think that personal is belonging to a particular person. Definitely it is. Personal. Mm -hmm. Lo que significa es lo que pertenece, ¿verdad? A una persona en específico, en particular. Okay. So that's it. Good. And obviously, personnel is people who work for a company. La gente que trabaja para una compañía, ¿verdad? El personal. En español, fíjense bien. Look at this. In Spanish, we have pe personal y personal. O sea, no te los tomes personal. Ese tema es muy personal. Y lo otro, mm, tenemos el personal de la empresa. El, pers el nuevo personal. 
se dan cuenta cómo tenemos, a estos se le llaman homófonos, porque homo es igual, suenan igual, pero tienen diferente significado. Ahora, el punto es, cuando nos dicen, ah, but Spanish is easy, el español es fácil. Mm -mm. Spanish is kind of difficult. Ahora, un americano que quiere identificar personal y personal de, de limpieza, personal de, de asuntos tuyos personales, so it's kind of hard, es un poco difícil. En cambio, ¿qué es más fácil? Personal, la gente que trabaja en una empresa, y personal, lo que pues eh, atañe a, a tus cosas ya íntimas, personales. Ok. Tell us. Um, we have one, two, three, four, and five. Complete the statements, las oraciones, with the appropriate. Miren eso, ap, no es appropriate, es appropri, appropriate word. Personal or personal, ¿ok? Volunteers for this, solo vamos a agregar personal or personal. ¿Ok, Pinto? What number? Number one, teacher. Number one. Who is the responsible for the personal or the plan? Ok, eh, ¿quién es responsable para personal o personal? Personal. Ok, aquí sería personal. Uh -huh. personal. Personal. Yes, that's it. La gente que trabaja en la planta. Ok, good. Here we have Oscar. Ok, Oscar, go. The number three. Go. It is necessary to try more. Uh, personal for the high season. For the high season, yes. So, they have to train. Tienen que capacitar. Similar to Carito and Duran. What they do with new personnel. That's it. That's correct. And who else? ¿Quién dijo yo? I don't know. After Oscar. Mm. Eli. And then Carlos. Okay, Eli. Okay, number four. Number four. Please, please do not bring your problem to the office. Mm -hmm. uh, sería personal. Yes. And, and that's, that's very important. Do not bring your personal problems. Something that you have problems at, in your family at home. Do not bring those problems to the work. Okay. Uh, Carlos, and then we go with Wendy. Okay. The personnel of the war, workshop, fight teacher, fight. Okay. Yes, of fine. the work, workshop need, need, need with uniforms. New un, uniforms. Okay. The personnel of the uniform. workshop, pobrecito, ya no tiene nuevo, ya está todo este de la ropa. Okay. Yes. They need new uniforms. Okay, Wendy, can you help us with number two? Does the marketing manager have a personal assistant? Okay. Does the marketing manager have a okay, personal, personal assistant. assistant? Okay, good. Referente a lo que trabaja. Thank you. Really good. Now, I don't know what's going on here. Esta nueva versión del PowerPoint no me gusta. Okay. What's the name of this song? En teoría, en teoría, le corresponde a Edwin. I don't know if Edwin is ready with your song. Edwin, ¿estarías lista con tu canción? Con mi canción. Yes. No. No. Ok. Pero dime un minuto, teacher. Ah, really? Ok. Si tú consideras. Te vamos a dar unos minutos, ¿ok? Para que la busques. Yep. Okay, okay. No problem, no problem. Ok, um, let's continue with the worksheet. Vamos a continuar con eh, un poquito. Ah, no, 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 no. Eh, nos faltan. What is the funniest thing some friends or relatives eh, have done? Ok, I like to hear. What about Gabriel? Are you ready with uh, your oh. answer? Ok. The funny is with my brother, we like it to let him ride a bike up a hill. Yes. A bike. Mm -hmm. um, una montaña. 
un ah, cerro, okay. un cerro, ahí bajábamos. With the bicycle. Sí. <laughs> ok. Did you ever fall down? ¿Alguna vez se cayeron? Trabados en un cerco. <laughs> well, and do you have scars? ¿Tienes cicatrices? No. No, no scars. No, no. Ok. No. Ok, good for you. Because sometimes we have some scars, especially boys. Boys have uh, scars in the forehead, right? Or in the cheek. Yes, yes, or yes. In every part of, of the face, uh, boys. And girls, maybe girls have some in the elbows. Las chicas a veces tienen en los codos. Or in the knees, en las rodillas. Okay, también. Yes, the, the girls have those kinds. But some, some other girls, they have also some scars. Tienen cicatrices. Thank you. And Wendy, are you ready? I know you have passed Wendy. Right. Okay. In this case, Steffi. Okay. No, Steffi. Yvette, what about you? Hello. Hello. Are you ready with your opinion for this? Uh, yes, um, um, a friend told me that for a concert of so many people she had lost one of her shoes, shoes and had to return home without the with, shoe. With one because. shoe, okay. Perdió, yes. perdió esos zapatos. Los yes. yes. Was it a high heel? Fue un tacón. No, no. Shoes. No, like, no. Sí, high, high heel. High heel. Wow, okay. that's really uncomfortable. Sí. Creo que es bien incómodo. <laughs> perdió el glamour, correct. la pobre. Yes. Yes, sí. No glamour, no fashion. Okay. Yes. Sí. Some things that happen, especially to, to two girls, definitely. Okay, well. Okay. We go. Thank you, um, Yvette. What about Oscar and Wilfredo? And then Pinto. Oscar, do you have yours? Okay, teacher. Yes. Yeah. Uh, uh, what is the funny thing some friends on that you have done? Uh, well, my children tell me that when they were, uh, were little, and the my uh, and my wife in were not at home. They moved the din thing in the dinner room armchair and left the thing free uh, free and filling by soap and water and drill on the floor and slide from on slide the other. Uh, they made this mess. Uh, today, Adu, tell me why, uh, how, how much funny it was for them. Okay. In the dining room, in the cocina, que hicieron relajo. Okay, in the yes, dining room. Uh, no, the, in the sala. Ah, uh, living room. Okay. Sí. Yes. Kids are, are experts to, uh, to make mess, hacer desorden. Yes, so they Demasiado. throw water, they throw wow, a lot of things. Agua, jabón, y todo ahí se okay, <laughs> okay, that's funny and dangerous as well. También un poquito peligroso. They can hit on the, the wall. Nick, the, the Nick, the, se lo, se lo uh, okay, well, bueno, ya les queda de recuerdo. Thank you, Oscar. Wilfredo en Pinto. Okay, Will, are you ready? Uh, the funniest thing that has happened to me is we left my cousin for dead on the beach. You forgot, olvidaste, you forgot a cousin in a playa, in the bed. Yes. yes. Okay, but did you find it soon? ¿Lo encontraste rápido? Sí, sí, me regresamos. Qué barbaro. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Good that nothing worse happened. Lo bueno que nada, nada, nada malo pasó. Nada peor. Okay, thank you. Pinto, what about you? You have some, some story, some anecdotes? Yes, I have an added anecdote. Okay. 
Some days, me and my friends, we are playing a court kickball. Kickball is the like like a baseball rules, but with uh -huh. a food. Okay, with a fruit, con fruta, or what? With a food. Ah, okay, with a food. Mm -hmm. it, it was my tour and, and my shoes were, was broken. <laughs> oh, come on, okay. Hey, so every, everybody saw, todo, todo el mundo te estaba viendo. Sí, sí. Okay. So, so when I, when I hit, hit the ball with, with all my soul, <laughs> my oh. shoes go flying like a bird. Like a bird. Sky. Okay. It was so funny because all, all, all people screaming and smiling. Okay. <laughs> So, so, yeah, but, but did you have socks? Tenías calcetines cuando salió volando el zapato? Yes, socks? I have. Okay, I have yes. Socks. Because sometimes mm -hmm. we have some holes in the socks. A ver, tenemos hoy en los calcetines. Uh -huh. Especially <laughs> boys. Boys, we are like very mess. Okay. Okay, I guess it's, mm -hmm. it happens sometimes. Nosotros a veces cuando estamos jugando así, dicen, se decía como bajar mangos, right? Because you throw mm -hmm. shoes. Okay, nice, my friends. We're going to almost to finish 12 minutes, 12 minutes. Okay, fast, simple, but yo creo que ya tenemos a Edwin. Edwin, are you ready with your song? Okay, yes. Um, okay, now you can share. Ahora puedes compartir pantalla. Sin el título, ¿verdad? Solo el texto, parte del texto. Okay, Edwin, how are you doing? Good? Como vas? Permítame que tengo fallas con la computadora. Eh, eh, es una, bueno, no el inicio, pero menos es una parte no es inicio de la de la no canción, no importa es, it, it's, okay. it's not necessary to be the beginning of the first part it can be the, the chorus coro or another another part pero lo importante es que puedas compartir okay, okay. okay eh, ahorita que está como la comparto ok en la parte esa es de la computadora verdad sí, sí verdad. ok en la parte de en medio abajo uh -huh. hay un botón verde que dice compartir pantalla o share screen mm, yeah. ok yeah. tienes que seleccionar el archivo una vez te sale una ventana tienes que seleccionar uh -huh. el archivo si lo tienes abierto sí ok do Okay. Um, can you read it? Puedes leerlo, please. Okay. Now and then. No, and then when I see her face, she stay me away to take a special a special place, and if I stare too long, it probably uh, break down and cry. Okay, I, I probably break down and cry. Okay. Uh, canta, cantadito. Ajá, Carito lo va a cantar. Dale, Carito, go, go. Miss Colombia. No, porque no sé cómo es, no me es el ritmo. Okay, uh, that's a very, but a very famous song. Come on. It's Una a classical pista. rock song. I feel yes, that yes. I... I hear it but i don't know what is come on guns and yeah. roses yes guns and yes. roses mm -hmm. now oh. and then when don't i cry? see her face no don't cry it's not don't cry it's not a ballad it's a very but, but, uh, no. mm. oh uh -huh. no oh. uh, it's a uh, sweet seal Oh my, Alba. Ah, sweet child, oh my. Oh, mine. 
Yes, no we one can my... see her face. Mm -hmm. Yes, thank you, Edwin. Well, very okay. good. good. Good likes. Bueno, gusto. Nice. Uh, pero deja de compartir, si no vamos a ver cosas. And th those could be really dangerous. Uh -huh. No, no hay nada, no hay nada que ocultar. Ok, yo te dejo de compartir, no hay problema, no hay problema. Si no vieras, ¿verdad lo que le vimos a Cari? Ok. Past simple irregular verbs. Ahora, eh, necesitamos empezar a ver el pasado de estos verbos, solo nos quedan, we have like eight minutes, ok, we're about to finish. So, eh, mainly, these are regular verbs. These are regular verbs. Solo quiero compartir algo. Let me see. We have like. Okay, no. Um, sorry. Parece si tenía ese archivo, pero no. Okay, those are um, verbs with n, los verbos que terminan en with ed, los que normalmente terminan con ed. Okay, so uh, I know that it is not so difficult. Ah, aquí está. Este. Okay, so. Esta se la voy a enviar. Los verbos irregulares, irregular verbs, que cuando están en pasado o pasado participio, que es fácil, it is easy because they just need ed. Solo necesitan ed para el pasado, ¿ok? So, estos, los verbos que están en, en ed, ¿verdad? Que también son estos mismos, um, ¿sí? sí Bueno, son los que los lo, lo, lo regulares tienen tres, tres, they have three forms to be pronounced. Tienen tres maneras para ser pronunciados. El primero eh, es la letra D, el segundo es la letra T y el otro es ID. O sea, ID en español, letra T en español, letra D en español. Ejemplo. Um, Tenemos estos. Todos estos, look at this. All of them are regular verbs. Todos estos son regulares. Todos, todos estos son regulares. Así que todos tienen ed al final. But the pronunciation in Spanish is d. La pronunciación en español es, es de, eh, perdón, en inglés es de. Called, failed, planned, cleaned, de. Killed, cancelled, stayed, arrived, prepared. Answered, de. Answered, discovered, cleaned. Ahora, el otro es con T. Y este es el que cuesta un poquito. Este sí cuesta un poco. So, in this case, no vamos a decir as que. Decimos as. Ese. Tenemos acá, no decimos parque. Decimos park. Park. No decimos cheque, decimos check. Ese cuesta. No sé si se alcanza a escuchar, ¿verdad? Check. Ok. Cook. Ok. Igual aquí tenemos missed. Past. Cash. Entonces, este sí, I consider, or in my opinion, is one of the most difficult because of, we don't have this sound in Spanish words. No tenemos este sonido en las palabras en español con la T al final. Siempre terminamos con otro tipo de consonante vocal. Y la otra es ID. Wanted. Rested. Planted. Acted. Pretended. Tasted. Invited. Hated. Ok. Waited. I'm going to send this image. Le voy a enviar esta imagen que es súper importante, ¿ok? This is quite important, ¿ok? So, just remember that for regular verbs, 
in past, para los verbos regulares en pasado, tenemos tres tipos de pronunciaciones. Todos, all of them, have ed at the end. Todos tienen ed al final. Todos, todos. Los verbos regulares. But what it make them different is the pronunciation at the end. La pronunciación al final es que lo que los hace diferente. Tenemos id, tenemos t, o tenemos la letra d. Ok. First, vamos a comenzar con estas que son los más fáciles, ¿ok? Seleccionen uno y con eso vamos a terminar, ¿ok? Carito, select one and then we go with Edwin. Cualquiera, entonces solo es como que dijésemos acá plan, pero con D, plan, o sea, hay una pequeña vibración. La D es interdental, la lengua en medio de los dientes, ¿verdad? Rain, ¿ok? Carito and Edwin, let's try, vamos a intentar. Travel. Good. Edwin Pinto. Drive. Nice. Carlos eh, Pinto and Wendy. Love. Uh -huh. Wendy Oscar. Discovered. Uh -huh. Perfect. Oscar Discovered. Ellie. Good. Ellie Yvette. Answered. Mm -hmm. Yvette Duran. Uh, fried. Okay, fried. Mm -hmm. um, fried. Okay, good. We go with. Can you make it down? Okay, we go with uh, Evelyn and Gabriel. Received. Mm -hmm. uh, Gabriel Nina. Fired. Uh -huh. Fired. Uh -huh. Nina Luis. Arrived. Mm -hmm. Good. Luis Mardo. Lived. Lived. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Carlo... uh, Mardo Carlos. Arrived. Nice. Carlos Kenia. Student. Okay. Uh -huh. Studied. Uh -huh. uh, here we have Kenia and Wilfredo. Enjoyed. Enjoyed. Mm -hmm. Wilfredo. Eh, Charlie. Ok. Eh, quiero que tomen en cuenta que estos temas ya no son del básico básico. These topics are like kind of advanced, son un poquito más avanzados porque se refieren a los detalles en la pronunciación. Y este ya se lo voy a enviar. Terminamos la clase y les envío esta imagen. Ok. It's really, really important to start studying past tense. Es muy importante para comenzar a estudiar el pasado de los verbos, que es lo que a la mayoría nos cuesta en algún momento. ¿Okay? Esto es así. Recuerden siempre tener el micrófono desactivado, please, Nina, and the others. Y este le voy a enviar. Eh, tomorrow vamos a, a continuar este, ¿cómo se llama? Con eh, esto, lo del pasado, porque sé que es un poco confuso. But we are going to go little by little. Vamos a ir poco a poco, ¿verdad? Esa es solo la intro. Y este, please, um, let me see. Tenemos. Necesito, I need, necesito que. Claudia me le dice, necesito que termine las tareas porque le hace falta. Eli, necesito que termine las otras. Creo que solo tres has terminado. ¿Verdad? Y Evelyn, creo que le hace falta una o dos. ¿Ok? Para que vayamos bien, porque ya voy a pasar las notas. ¿Ok? Sí, pueden hacerme el esfuerzo. And tonight we have Edwin. Tenemos eh, la sesión con Edwin ahora. ¿Ok? I'm going to check the attendance list. Quick. Voy a reviso la lista de asistencia rápido. ¿Ok? Edwin se me queda, pero comenzamos con Carlos. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Quinto. I'm here, teacher. Carito. I'm here, teacher. Edwin. Present teacher. Ellie. Present teacher. Steffi, no Steffi. Evelyn. Gabriel. Present teacher. Ok. Durán. Present teacher. Okay. Yvette. Present teacher. Nice. Kenia. Present teacher. Luis. Present teacher. Mardo. Good night, teacher. Good night. Oscar. Good night. Nina. Teacher. Present okay. teacher. Wilfredo. Good. Wendy. Present teacher. Ok, my friend. Present teacher. Ok, see you tomorrow. Nos vemos mañana. Ok, bye bye. See you tomorrow. Ok, bye bye. Good night. Night.
Okay, Edwin, do we have <clears throat> some vocabulary mm -hmm. that you want to reinforce? Algún vocabulario que te gustaría reforzar? Any topic that you would like to study in a couple of minutes? You have doubts? Okay. Tienes dudas? Por ejemplo, tengo un poco de dificultades con lo del, que estaba mencionando con lo del el pasado. Ok, ¿la voz pasiva o el pasado en, en general? Eh, de voz pasiva. Ok, la voz pasiva ahorita. Uh -huh. Permítame. Por ejemplo, en, eh, bueno, en una imagen que subió de, de ejemplo, donde dice he opens the door y en la otra es la voz pasiva que da como ejemplo the door is opening by yeah. him. Yes. Entonces, eh, tengo una yeah. pequeña duda ahí. Uh -huh. Ok, ok, yes, uh, I understand. And the passive voice is kind of, kind of difficult topic. Un poco difícil este tema, because it's confusing. Ok, and if you notice, the first sentence is like the normal sentence that we use to express ideas, to say, to describe actions, ¿verdad? Para ex expresar ideas mm -hmm. y describir acciones, lo hacemos así. He opens the door. Tenemos el sujeto, el verbo y el objeto. So, the action is over the object. La acción recae, la acción que es abrir recae en el objeto. Object, mira, sujeto, el protagonista, la persona que hace las cosas, la acción y quién o la cosa que recibe la acción. Ahora, uh -huh. now in the passive voice is on the contrary. Esto pasa al inicio de la oración, mira. Quien recibe la acción. Yes, y tenemos el verbo que pasaría a participio, participio. Si es regular, fácil, le agregamos ED. Pero si es irregular, tenemos que memorizarlo. That's tendría the que, difficult sí, part. Tendría que modificar por el... Ajá. That's mm -hmm. it. And easy y fácil. Solo le agregamos el verb be. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Puede ser yeah. am, mm -hmm. is, are. ¿Ok? Mm -hmm. Ahora, esto no es necesario. Porque aquí decimos él abre la puerta. ¿Ok? No problem. Mm -hmm. Pero aquí dice la puerta está abierta. No importa quién la abrió. Lo que importa es que está abierta. ¿Ok? Es la acción. Es la acción lo que importa. La acción lo que uh -huh. importa y, y el objeto. ¿Ok? So now uh -huh. I'm going to present some other... Um, vamos a ver otra vez lo, lo, los ejemplos. We have some examples here. Let me see. Ok. Ok. <clears throat> Igual, ¿verdad? Aquí tenemos, he opens the door. And the passive voice is, the door is opened by him. Ahora, acá, in this case, puedes ver que está by him, pero no es necesario. Si nosotros queremos, mm -hmm. lo omitimos. It's not necessary. Okay. Now, let's try to do some of these sentences. Por al, al menos hagamos una, dos o tres. Okay? Let's try. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Relax. Take your time. Number four. The picture. Uh huh. Is a. Uh huh. What would it be? It would be. Is. Yes. The picture is. Y ahora vamos con draw. Is draw. Uh huh. Is. Uh huh. El verbo en pasado es un irregular. Ese cambia un poco. Cambia un poquito, okay? The picture is drawn. Te das cuenta que le agregamos una N, o sea, ya es participio. Aquí dice, la pintura está dibujada. O, o la foto está dibujada. Ok. Let's uh, do another. Vamos a hacer otro. Ok. La number two. Number two. We set the table. Uh -huh. Ya no diría we. Uh -huh. La primera palabra sería... Uh, the table. Table. Ajá. Uh -huh. La el set creo que es set creo que es un verbo irregular. Eh, sí. Solo que hace falta algo antes del verbo principal. Hace falta the table. 
eh, are? No, porque estamos hablando de una mesa. Sí, ah, es un verbo, sería, el verbo be, pero es singular. Ajá. Sería... It. Is. Perfect. The table is... Y la ventaja de este verbo es que no cambia. Es bien raro este verbo. O sea, no cambia. O sea, sería... The table is set. Este se parece a otro verbo que es hit. Hit significa golpear. Pero hit en pasado, en pasado participio, no cambia. Igual que este verbo, put es poner. No cambia, fíjate. Bien curioso estos verbos, pero son irregulares. ¿Ok? En esta oración, eh, como menciona nosotros, si se pidiera especificar quién se podría poner. Eh, by us, sería por nosotros. nosotros. Us es, ajá. Pero como no importa, aquí la, la oración es, we set the table, nosotros arreglamos la mesa. Y aquí sería, la mesa está arreglada, o la mesa está ordenada. Table is set. Ok, let's go uh, to the last. Vamos a la última, porque se nos acaba el tiempo. Ok, Edwin. Okay, eh, la número three. Number three, ok. Uh -huh. She the pays money, a lot of money. The money is... Pay, creo que es verdad. Ajá. Aquí sería pay. Es pay. irregular. Uh -huh. A lot. The money. No. The money no, is pay. pay. Sencillo. Yo creo que te confundiste con esto. Uh -huh. Con play. Uh -huh. sí. Ahí sí lleva ed. That's a regular. Ese sí es regular. Pero ya viste como una L cambia la cosa, ¿verdad? Ah, but mm -hmm. that's it. The money is paid. So, um, in conclusion, you can see that every passive voice, at least, al menos con este, que estamos utilizando el passive voice, they need verb be. Necesitan el verbo to be. ¿Ya? Y necesitan el, el, el verbo en pasado participio. ¿Ok? Ok, Edwin. Así que hasta acá terminamos. Me alegra ver que, que estás avanzando. Siento que estás eh, adquiriendo más vocabulario. I like it. Me gusta. Espero que siempre le dediques un poco de tiempo porque recuerda que esto es práctica. Practice and practice. Ok. Ok. Así que pues un gusto. Ok. See you tomorrow. Okay. Veo mañana. Entonces. Bye bye, my friend.